I remember a moment early on in our dating when I wasn't sure if I could keep living in Korea. You sat down with me and we went through all of our options together. It made my worries feel so much smaller. It made me feel like if we're together, nothing's too big of a deal. That day made me think this relationship might just be the big one. In the first year of our relationship, we went on a camping trip together in Korea, and we drove for 10 hours on your motorbike <laughs> to a lake <laughs> um, in the countryside. And I loved how you included me in your friend traditions. It, it was a trip that you went on with your friends every year, and it felt really special to go on it together. Um, you always made me feel very accepted and included. And I love how you make the best of any situation and you bring positivity and excitement to anything that we do, even the challenging. <laughs> <laughs> the last thing that I want to tell you is about one moment in our future that I'm looking forward to. The moment that I think of is in the quiet of old age when life's heavy lifting is done. I'm simply happy being near you. And to be with you, both of us a little grayer, surrounded by knitting and memories, I imagine a warmth and sweetness to that time. It's that moment of quiet, loving company that I look forward to. I feel incredibly lucky to have found someone that I connect with emotionally and also creatively. And I know that we'll build something even more incredible with one another's support than we would have alone. Kelly, you're exquisite. You've made my life simple. From the first days of knowing you, I've been so impressed with how little attention you draw to yourself and how you draw your confidence from within. I'm not sure how I came to meet someone like you with the depth of your creativity and the fire of your intelligence, but I'm so thrilled that it's you who'll be with me on this journey. <laughs>